Alex. I'm the marketing manager here at Trade Social, joined by our CEO, Wael. Salam. Hello, my friend. Uh, so well, we're in our new Cyprus offices in Limassol. So Trade Social has really been growing and expanding. Uh, also, we have recently announced the Dubai office uh, opening in the DIFC, mm -hmm. and uh, as well as the Innovation Lab. Could you tell us a little bit more about that, what it is, and the plans for the office there? Sure. So we have received our license in Dubai uh, two months ago, uh, and the. Uh, the concept behind the Dubai office is to act as a global operational headquarters for the whole group. Um, in addition to that, uh, we are looking to set up a business development unit that will be looking after institutional and uh, banking products in the MENA region. Uh, and finally, the um, main objective for the office as well is to act as an innovation lab. So all our customized products, all our prototypes, uh, the new uh, products that are in development in the time uh, in the pipeline will be planned and set up in Dubai and then be moved to our development offices in our other areas yeah. and so on. Awesome. Uh, you touched on upon uh, the new products. So this uh, whole year in 2019, uh, Trade Social has been releasing quite a few new products, yes. solutions, including mobile applications. Uh, could you tell a little bit uh, the viewers about that as well? Sure. So. Um, so, uh, of course, uh, as everyone knows, we started with our applications in terms of uh, mirror trading applications and mobile trading applications. So the main course of development with these older applications is that we've released our own order management system, our own fixed engine. The platforms became completely independent, so we don't rely on a third party technology anymore, but the platform and the solution can be ran independently, connected directly to the liquidity providers and market data vendors. Now, in addition to that as well, we have added the mobile application, which increased uh, user activation and the user application of the software itself. Uh, and added value to this, we have increased or uh, issued more, more investor experiences, mm -hmm. uh, such as a trading platform, both for professional traders and for novice traders. Uh, and in addition to that, we have also released our robo-advisor solution, which allows advisory companies to uh, offer their investment products and portfolios to newbie investors uh, with a full application suite that allows the uh, financial institution to run uh, AML compliance suitability, uh, suitability risk systems uh, over their clients. And finally, we have released our ETF station, uh, which allows any financial institution to uh, generate their own ETF and launch it and authorize it to their own clients to allow them to instantly subscribe and redeem from these ETF products and investment products offered by the institution. So mainly that covers our development uh, scope for the 2019 and of course we are uh, always looking for more customized products and solutions from financial institutions to offer them to our uh, to our existing and potential clients. That's really interesting because I mean uh, now Trade Social covers anything from FX brokers down to investment banks, uh, mm -hmm. pension funds, etc. etc. Et mm -hmm. so, so quite a development and also what we've recently launched is the marketplace. Yes. Can you touch up on a little bit on that and what it is and what we're trying to achieve with it? So the marketplace allows, uh, uh, allows technology com companies and and fintech companies to partner together and our version of this is allowing uh, market data providers, liquidity providers, aggregators, uh, fund administrative mm -hmm. companies to be able to come and join our marketplace, join our ecosystem and make their services available to our existing clientele and our potential clientele. Mm -hmm. So the concept is to leverage on partnership, leverage our ecosystem and our products on partnerships with other institutions to be able to uh, provide a more uh, a more added value to our existing product and create a mutually beneficial partnership with other sister technology companies. Excellent. Uh, speaking of partnerships, we have announced uh, quite a few big names already that joined the marketplace yes. and uh, that are currently being added. Um, you just came back from London. Mm -hmm. uh, how was that trip for you guys? Was it successful? Did you kind of meet some bigger names, is there something else we should be expecting soon? Well, uh, yes, we are always running on... Um, first of all, visiting London is always eye-opening with the 
uh, clients and the financial institutions that are available over there uh, fits exactly the mode that we are trying to deliver. Uh, in addition to that, we had very extensive meetings with the higher grade institutions. Uh, of course, all of them will be released. All of these announcements will be released very shortly. But one of our main uh, setups was this, uh, finalizing our deal with interactive brokers. And this is what we announced uh, a few days ago. And I believe that over the course of the next two weeks, we will have more partnerships lined up and further announcements that leverage our technology, our product. And at the end of the day, it enhances our solutions to our clients and their underlying investors. Excellent. Uh, excellent. Looking forward to, uh, to all of those announcements coming up. And uh, I'm, I'm aware of the trips coming up, but could you briefly mention where we could, uh, where financial institutions could catch yourself or the rest of the team yeah. in the next few months? Yeah, our team will be very busy over the course of the next few weeks and months. And thanks, of course, to our marketing department to organize all of this. But uh, our timeline over the course of the next few weeks will be organizing trips and attending events uh, in South Africa, in London, uh, in Hong Kong. Uh, that should cover between September to October. In November, we will be attending again in London, in Australia, in Dubai, and in Abu Dhabi. Uh, so there will be a mix of events that we or seminars that we are organizing, or there are events that we are participating and exhibiting and attending in. And I believe the schedule will be available on our website, will be available on social media. So I hope that uh, our potential exist and existing clients can meet us to get an understanding of what we have coming up in the very near future or the interesting developments and the trends that we have been able to accumulate and offer to our clients during these workshops and seminars. Perfect. Uh, well, just want to say a big thank you to you all for finding the few minutes to sit down with me. I know you're super busy, so thank you for that. And uh, looking forward to having you back here in Cyprus soon. Thank you very much. And uh, yeah, guys, stay tuned for more videos coming from Trade Social regarding company updates, product updates, and everything in between. Thank you. Thanks. Thank you.